What is going on guys, FaZe Rug here and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video and this one's actually crazy. So yesterday I was out with my friend and I got a call from my mom and she's kind of like screaming. She's like, oh my god, where are you? Like, are you okay? What what area are you in? And I'm like, oh, I'm at the mall. Why? What? Like, what happened? And she's like, there's a shooting literally near our house. Guys, when I tell you guys near our house, four minutes away. Literally four minutes away from our house. I have the address here because like, or I have the street where it happened look at this guys four minutes drive literally four minutes away from my house my mom's like she was driving and she saw like a billion cop cars SWAT teams cops with like guns like pointing at a door at a house my mom witnessed this and she told me like you should come back and vlog this and I'm like um I, I don't think that'd be the smartest idea to do to go and try to vlog this because maybe the shooter will freaking shoot me in the face but um yeah she said she saw it and the cops told her to just get the fuck out of here and like go the other way go back home and right now I'm gonna go to the street the guy listen this is the craziest part so they had him trapped in the house right and the guy had someone held hostage I believe because from like what I've read on the news and shell show, show you guys some of the news things but they said he told one of the people to go out that was in that house he was hiding in and somehow some way he escaped he is on the loose at the moment but he's not in this area anymore he went to like this area called la jolla which is like 20 minutes away that's where they like last spotted him or that's where like they think he is now but that's insane they didn't catch him they had a swat team surrounding the whole house helicopters and all that and he escaped how does that even happen? But anyways, I'm gonna go to the street and try to see like if there's any like tape around the place or like, cause they were showing it on the news this morning as well and it showed like I, like the park they were at was like, it's two minutes away from my house. I'm like, holy shit, like I wanna get this for my vlog. Hopefully I don't get shot. If I get shot, I freaking love you guys, all right? Just know that. All right guys, so this is the street where it happened. And I don't see like, obviously it's been a day since it happened. Any escape from the house, so I wouldn't assume that like, the SWAT team and things would still be out here, but it's insane. It literally happened four minutes away from my house. I don't know exactly which house it was, but that's fucking insane that it happened this close to my house. I'm gonna show you guys all the news reports and stuff, but that's just really, really creepy. Honestly, my biggest fear is like kidnappers or shooters, stuff like that, not like, scary things like you know scary movies like freddy krueger and freaking the exorcist and stuff i'm more terrified of like real shit happening as in like kidnapping shootings and like you know you know what i mean that's what i'm more terrified about and like guns and stuff i don't know those those just really really scare me that's just me i don't know about you guys like what scares you guys the most what i don't know fuck whenever i hear about like school shootings or like just shootings in general i'm just like how does someone have the nerve to like grab a gun and Pull the trigger and killing innocent people. It just makes no sense to me. So right now I'm heading to the park where the news channel was this morning. Hopefully, like, I don't know if they're still there. It was like an hour ago or two hours ago. And they had like security tape all around the park because I think that's where like the suspect was as well. Not only on that street, that's where like he escaped from, but he was seen like many other places. I'm surprised they didn't catch it, but the fact that he's on the loose within this area, like literally 20 minutes away from me, this was five minutes away, like, it's fucking scary, and I really hope they capture him because any shooter should not be on the loose. Shout out Wagon High Middle School, my middle school, I freaking love you. Um, okay, so this is the park where the news was shooting earlier, and it looks fine, like no security caution tape, how it was before. Hmm, that's weird. Maybe they shot it yesterday as well, because like I said, this is the next day. I was not about to go out um, the same time around when like this whole thing was happening but when i get home i'm gonna show you guys like the news and everything when i saw this like after my mom told me i looked it up i was like mary mesa shooting literally was so scary there was like a standoff um i don't know it was insane seeing all those like swat cars and swat teams on the same streets that i live in you know so i'm gonna stay in my house today you know just to be safe i actually did have a dentist today um just to like check on my teeth and stuff and it's in La Jolla, and that's where the suspect was last spotted. So, you know, I'm gonna have to cancel that. I'm gonna have to cancel that appointment. I'm really not gonna go. That's, I'm not gonna put myself in danger for like a dentist appointment. These people next to me are watching me vlog. Yeah, guys, don't worry. I'm gonna be safe. I'm gonna be in my house, lock all my doors and shit. And um, I tweeted about it, and all you guys were concerned, saying be safe, be safe. I appreciate that. I love you guys. Guys, does that look a little familiar, the scenery? I literally was just driving on this road like 10 minutes ago. And I don't see, like, obviously it's been a day since it happened. Any escape, that's what the suspect looks like. And you guys want to know a crazy story real quick? You guys probably won't believe me, but it's just insane. Because, like, 
the crazy shit always happens. So, like, a couple days ago, I was at the gas station, and the suspect, like, they showed him on the news today, and I'm like, holy shit, that guy looks like he works at the gas station, because, like, this guy, I would see him, I'm telling you, he even went to my school, like, not even, he wasn't even a student, he would just go hang out with some people at school, and we'd all see him, even my cousin told me, like, oh, doesn't he look familiar, and I'm like, yeah, I'm like, I swear to you guys, I saw this guy working last week, and I've seen him multiple times, like, ten times, and I'd always say, what's up to him, and he'd be like, hey, what's up, man, like, how's your day, like, we'd literally conversate, and, like, I saw him three days ago at the gas station, and on the news, they're like, he works at a gas station, they didn't, like, say which gas station, but I'm like, holy shit, that's pretty weird that he works at a gas station. And you guys want to know the craziest part? So, two days ago, I went to the same gas station to try going inside, and, um... Ah! <laughs> Brennan. Brennan, fuck you. I thought my fuck brown shoes were going to be... you. Wait, hold on, wait. Actually, you got me so good. Did you think I was a shooter? I look like him, huh? Guys, his description is 5'8", 135, mustache and Hispanic. I'm 5'9", 138, mustache. You look a lot Hispanic. of people tell me I look Hispanic. Wait, Brennan, you actually gave me the biggest heart of my heart is beating so fast. Imagine I'm just at the gym playing basketball and the fucking cops come back. They come and tackle you. Yeah, exactly. They fucking shoot you on spot. And I call foul, foul, foul. <laughs> no, but for real, I went to the gas station the other day and... The doors were locked. Like, the gas station that I go to is open 24 hours. I'm sure almost all gas stations are for you guys, too. Like, the inside, and I was going to go get, like, snacks and stuff like that. And I go, and the doors are locked. There was a paper saying, like, closed today or some shit like that. And I was like, that's so weird. Like, usually this is never closed. And then the next day, this happens, and I'm like, whoa. Like, this is just fucking crazy. Like, that's one of the craziest things ever. But this man bolted when an officer approached him in the block of Blank Avenue shortly after 2 p.m. And that's when, like, my mom called me, like, around, like, 3 or 4. Officers surrounded him. Officers entered the home, but the suspect was not inside and his whereabouts remained unknown. The gunfire left one person with wounds. Shootings near my area. Usually whenever I hear, like, school shootings of, like, in different states and stuff, I still get scared for, like, all the people living there. But, like, now the fact that it's, like... Five minutes away from my house and he's on the loose now. That's insane. Fuck. That's crazy. If you guys see that person, I like showed you guys what he looks like. You guys know what to do. Call the cops. Anyone that lives in the San Diego area, be safe out there. Who knows where he is now? He could be in our backyard. He could be in my closet right now listening to what I'm saying. What am I doing, you guys may all ask? Well, three, two, one. Oh, shit. We about to play some Call of Duty up in this bitch. Finally. Fucking Call of Duty. I'm telling you guys, I'll play for fun here and there. They want me to play. I think Apex is recording a video. I'm here playing Black Ops 2 with my face friends. It's been a long time, so watch me hit a shot for his game. I don't know whose channel this is going to go on, but I think we're just recording, like, SD gameplay. Hopefully, I'll hit a shot for you guys. If I hit a shot, I think it's going to be on Apex's channel, so... I'm gonna have a lot of fun right now. Hope you guys enjoy this video. It's kind of like a little short video just like explaining the whole shooting thing, which is kind of insane, but anytime something crazy like this happens, obviously, I wanna talk about it in my video. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. Drop a like on this video. If you don't drop a like on this video, I'll be next on the list of the shooters. So please, do it for me. Just drop a like on this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great Easter day. And other than that, it's been Rug. I'm about to hit a shot for you guys. If you guys, if this video hits 50,000 likes, I'm hitting a shot in this video, alright? I'm hitting a shot for Apex. Whoever is recording this video, I was just told to come play. Other than that, it's been Rug and I'm out. Peace.